I hold an advantage experientially, potentially, physically, mentally, spiritually over every person in this tournament. That means I'm winning the mind game, the head game, the heart game. My name is Matt Seidel. Come see what I'm saying. I'm known as a high flyer. Some of my earliest memories of flipping just took place in my front yard or in my backyard on my trampoline. That's really where I got the feel for the air, but I got the feel for the ground when I was an amateur wrestler. I was freshman wrestler of the year at my high school, but I quickly abandoned that because my destiny was to be a pro wrestler, and that's all I ever really wanted. When I was younger, I even took Taekwondo. And that's sort of where I learned my early kicks, my crescent kick, my hook kick, my question mark kick. I've always found that athleticism will give you an edge. However, lately in my career, I have had a tough foot injury to overcome. So I do walk with a limp, but my foot ends up being loaded. I actually have a huge lump on the top of my foot that's made out of calcified bone. And so when I can find a place for that kick, it does the most damage. But it's one of these cases where I actually have to suffer for the victory. And that's not something I'm afraid to do. When I first arrived into Ring of Honor, I was in college, I was in my junior year. Uh, I remember walking through the halls and just thinking, man, as soon as I drop this piece of paper off, I can cut out, drive to Cape Girardeau, we can head up to Minnesota, and the opportunity's there. The opportunity to be a part of Ring of Honor. This is back in 2004, and then as it is now, the best wrestling has been Ring of Honor, and I've always wanted to be a part of it. My first round match with Delirious is the most puzzling match I've had in so long. From the moment I entered wrestling, I was just wrestling blind. And it wasn't until I met Delirious that I had my eyes open. The only person in a 500 mile radius of where I lived saw wrestling the same way, loved it the same way, and wanted to be a part of it. And wanted to not just be a part of it, but to create our own. And Delirious is the first person that ever pushed me to get outside my comfort zone, to stand up for myself, the only person in wrestling in my young career that gave me any value, that ever believed in me. Without him, I would have no career. It's as simple as that. And that's why this is such a puzzling proposition, because I don't know what I'm gonna do. It's, it's like wrestling myself, but in a funhouse mirror. The only way to know what's gonna happen is to actually put it in the ring, to have those two pieces come into contact with each other and so early on in our career, when we met and we collided, it created an explosion that became all of this. And we're gonna have that same explosion in this pure championship match. Ring of Honor is like this transcendental object at the end of time that keeps pulling me towards it. I feel an obligation, a debt to the veterans of the past that have taught me, a debt to the fans of the past that have brought me here to take that pure championship and live up to what it embodies. To prove that it's that heart, mind, and soul connection that has always made the Ring of Honor Pure Championship special. I am the man to carry on that legacy. I am at the crest of the wave of this business. My name is Matt Seidel. Come see what I'm saying. Johnny says, this is delirious. In the battles of his egg, it was rigged in 20 hunter hunters. I know, Joe Bernard, Ring of Honor, Jimbo Chase. Boop, 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 boop. So, what can I say? I can come all over that dish there with this. That's a beat on wet then, and teen in dog with it. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da
Oh, it was only with him in the S12 support, Master Idell. Oh, it was all about you, I get a minute. So, what about us? I like to come all over that dish there with us. I did not do it. Schism and schism. Shut up! I know. Da, where the boss left me? Da. And so, my guns in and I break those. Master of my boy, get over there! Don't worry! Don't worry, say, Ben and me, I thought they were easy. Don't go there, say, Master Dams. Don't be coming up and then they'll be so can lose that about two for treasure. So we're going to. And don't lose any of the guns today. So it's going to be about two for treasure. Don't go there, say, Master Dams. Don't be coming up and then they'll be so can lose that about two for treasure. And so my guns in and I break those. I know. Don't worry, I. Go back, Jack. This one will be. Yeah, I was so. And I bought away.